Hi, my pupils. Hi, my pupils. I'm Miss Iman Sayyid uh, from Learn with Teacher Iman channel. Uh, today, our video about how to write a paragraph. This video for grades uh, three and four who uh, learned how to write a paragraph. Today, I will revive this uh, item on on uh, on this video. Uh, this item uh, in this video. Uh, but before I will go to our uh, video, to the, uh, our lesson today, I would like to say, don't forget to make share, like, subscribe to my channel, send you new videos. Let's go to our lesson today. Our lesson today about writing paragraphs, about writing paragraphs. Uh, this uh, this um, this uh, item or this topic is for grade uh, three and four, grade three and grade four. Can watch this video to perfect topic because both you both uh, ha have the same lesson how to write a paragraph and, the, and this item is uh, is in in, uh, in, the, in the exam. Uh, today I would like to, to talk about writing paragraph. I I to, uh, uh, I learned, I explained before how to write a, a paragraph, but I will repeat it again to know how to write it. How to write a paragraph? Writing paragraph. How to write a paragraph? Uh, first of all, the paragraph consists of many sentences. First of all, we have sentence one. Sentence one is general, simple sentence. It says the topic is about topic. Talk about the topic. Like what? Like here. Example: The Greek pyramid of Giza is very famous. So this is the topic uh, sentence or not? Yes, this is the topic sentence. Uh, se sentence two and three gives more information about topics that called support sentence in, in another meaning. Why? Because it gives you the details about this topic. Like what? Like this, like this. It's about 5,000 uh, years old and about 146 meters high. It was built by King Fofu. Sentence four, it will be the conclusion or summary uh, or an opinion. This is the sentence, this is the last sentence. It presents a summary, a summary, a summary, or it can use a summary or a brief. Both are both are the same. Or an opinion. Like what? Example. I love to visit the Great Pyramid of Giza. Okay. Let's go to another. Uh, we'll have uh, some uh, some paragraphs. I would read it to you to know more about this stuff. Here we have some paragraphs. Here is we have a, to a topic here about Dumyat governing. The, the land in Dumyat uh, governing, governing is rich in nutrients. The farmers can grow potatoes, lemons, rice, uh, tomatoes, and guavas. Fishermen catch thousands of fish to the sea. Dumyat cheese is very famous. Life is, is good. In Dumya. this is the kind of, of uh, this is the kind of paragraphs that we uh, that I would like to know. Uh, here is a here is a topic sentence. The land in uh, in Dumya government is uh, rich in nutrients. Uh, th uh, this is a topic sentence. Then uh, we give the details in the second sentence. Give the details in support. The farmers can grow potatoes, lemons, rice, uh, to, uh, tomatoes, and guavas. Fishermen catch thousands of fish in the sea. Dumyat uh, cheese is very famous. Life is uh, this is the support. This is the concluding sentence or or the summary of the sentence. Life is good in Dumyat. Let's go to another topic here. It is animals in desert. We see we, we sometimes think that some animals are scary, are scary or ugly, but they all important snakes and crocodiles. Are very dangerous, but they do a very important job. They eat insects, 
herds and the herds. This control the number of these animals. This control is the number of these animals. Let's go to another topic here. Tibi eagle. This is a, the kind of uh, birds. It's tibi eagle. Beautiful. Uh, here is here is here is give, give you the, some uh, some words to help you in writing birds. Black like beautiful. Eat female and male. The tibi eagle is is beautiful. The tibi eagle eats birds, small mammals, and rabbits. The female is bigger and heavier than the male. Let's go to the last one here. Phoenix fox. Phoenix fox. The phoenix fox lives in the desert. The phoenix fox eats insects, small lizards, small lizards, and mice. It, uh, its ears are big. The fox loses heat, loses heat from from what from its ears during the day. The foxes uh, pick few, few, few uh, the the foxes pick few the uh, the fox the foxes pick few keeps it keeps it warm at night uh, at night okay, keeps it warm at night. Today we finished uh, our uh, lesson. Uh, thanks a lot and see you meet again. Goodbye.